Hi, this book here is blocked because of copyright infringement. So that's why I'm showing you this. This is my KDP listings and you can see this book is blocked. So in today's video, I'll be showing you the correct way to write a book with ChatGPT. There's a huge hype on YouTube right now on how to use ChatGPT to write a book and publish on Amazon to make money, all right? There are a lot of channels showing how to do this. But what I've discovered in those videos is the same thing that got my books blocked by Amazon KDP. They actually mixed a few steps that prevent your book from being blocked or even termination of your account. So in this video, I'm going to show you the correct way to use ChatGPT so that you can publish your book without the fear of being blocked and start making money, all right? These are the do's and don'ts of ChatGPT. You can actually use ChatGPT for idea generation. You can also use it for to get your writing started, all right? And the don't is don't use ChatGPT to replace your writing. Don't use, don't use ChatGPT to replace your thinking. And number three is don't just copy and paste whatever ChatGPT gives you because you have to verify if it is correct or not, okay? And this is what a lot of YouTube video is teaching you to just copy and paste and guys, this does not fly with Amazon, okay? So, how do you use ChatGPT correctly? This can be done in just three simple steps. Number one is generate content, all right? Give ChatGPT a prompt and a response is this way. And you can see ChatGPT will start to write for you, okay? But most people will just copy and paste the content, then publish on Amazon. Like I said, it does not fly with Amazon KDP, all right? So that will take me to my step two. The step two is customization. You have to customize your writings, all right, in order to make it original, okay? So in step two, I'm going to be cover the rewrite, add your own input, then fact check, all right? That will be our step two, okay? You have to rewrite whatever ChatGPT gives you because so many people are into ChatGPT and the chances of getting the same answer is very, very high, okay? So you have to make the writing your own. So if you want to write your own, you can use a site called cubeworth.com. Then you can use Google extension called Upper AI, okay? Upper AI. I will link it also in the description below. You can use it to paraphrase. This is what I mean. If you come to my ChatGPT here now, let me copy this, for example, and I come to keyboard.com and I paste here and you can see all I need is paraphrase for me this way and this um, software online software is powerful that it gives you so many options in order to paraphrase to make it original you can see this understanding the power of Amazon KDP has you can see understanding Amazon KDP potentials you can click on this and it gives you more you know options to choose from I can say value power effectiveness possibility what performance and this list just go on like that okay and the same thing with this with the revolutionary amazon kdp as you can maximize the potential for the success of your book all you need to do is just click revolutionary and it gives you you know other alternatives that you can use you can use it on the grant breaking then you can maximize so you can all you have to do this is just play with this just to make your own writing original okay then appai is the same thing all you need to do for appai like i said i will link the extension address in the description video so that you can download the install then it will be helping you to paraphrase let me choose appai now all you need to do is just copy this you can see this down here you can see here these are the upper extension upper dot here extension here so all i need to do is just click on this and it will bring up this interface to rewrite i will all i need is just to paste here then I will ask to rewrite, just click enter, then it will write for you. As you can see this, it's writing for you. So let's compare the two together. You can see here now, this is different from this one because this has paraphrased it. That's the power of upper.ai and it's different from what we got from ChatGPT. This is what we got from ChatGPT. Unlock the potential of your book success with game-changing Amazon KDP ads. As you can see, this unleashes the true potential of your book success with Amazon KDP ads. Explore the transportive impact of this groundbreaking ads for authors in our captivating video. Gain invaluable knowledge on how they can revolutionize your book visibility and propel extraordinary sales growth. And it's different from this. This is unlock the potential of your book success with game-changing Amazon um, KDP has. In this video, we dive into why these are game changer for authors and how they can transform your book visibility and sales group. You can see it is quite different, but saying the same thing. 
I helped you to transform this, rewrite this, even this is what ChatGPT gave for us of making it original value, okay? So let's move on now. All you need to do is just copy this, copy whatever you have paraphrased, just copy here, and you can go to a site called writer.com to check for the humanly generated content or it is AI content. So what I do need is just to paste this here, and I come here to say, analyze test for us and let's see what it brings out if it is you can see this is human generated content fantastic with this app of copying from ChatGPT, paste it to Qbot, then rewrite it in your own word then come and check for the ai content detector like writer.com you can use anyone you like but i use writer.com most of the time to check if it is fantastic or it is ai written so you can see it's 99 percent human generated content which is great guys you're not copying verbatimly from ChatGPT just to you know paste on amazon and be to make money all right like i said this can lead to your termination of your account and our step three is final check which we have done we scan the test for ai which is great this is humanly generated 99 uh, percent content then we check for plagiarism for plagiarism you can use grammarly to check for that you can use grammarly to check for plagiarism in your book say free extension just install and install into your uh, chrome browser then it helps you to fine tune your writings and check for plagiarism you can see this there's no anything to correct because this is my icon for grammarly all right there's nothing to correct here these sentences are perfect, all right? So you can check all these with grammar, like I said. Let us go over some hacks and idea on using ChatGPT for KDP. Number one hack is you can use ChatGPT for keyword ideas. Guys, if you don't know what to publish on, you can use ChatGPT for keywords ideas. So let's type, you can give ChatGPT a prompt like, hey, Chat, give me a list of coloring book niches on Amazon. Just click on enter, and it gives you so many niches on Amazon, like I said, this hack is just with a twist, all right? So that because it is just like garbage in, garbage out sort of thing when it comes to KDP, you have to know the proper prompt you are giving ChatGPT to give you the desired answer you need, all right? So instead of writing, give me a list of coloring niches on Amazon, you can write like, give me a new list with popular adult coloring book niches that's unique and unusual so you click on enter here then with this now you get what is not popular on amazon and as you can see here you can see day of the dead coloring book i've never seen this before you can see um psychedelic and trippy art coloring book you can see dot do z tango coloring book cosmotic and celestial coloring book tattoo coloring book guys you can see even this i've not seen this before steampunk gothic and dark fantasy day of the dead and also these are not common when it comes to coloring book like i said what you type to what you give chat is what chat gives to you and this act now with a twist that give me the least popular adult coloring book which is that unique that is unique and unusual right now you can see this that is not is not everywhere these are unique now and unusual and in fact i'll go and uh, i'll go to amazon to do my due diligence on these keywords all right and number two you can use chat gpt for book titles all right so let's give chat gpt something like let's give chat gpt create 10 funny books funny book titles for a joke book for kids so let us click enter and see what it brings for us like i said you can use it for book titles you can see this now um gigu galore the laugh route chronicles tickles your funny bones joke for the jolly juniors and you know the list just go on like that i also advise that when you get this kind of book titles try to rewrite it because you never can say this the same title might be on amazon so try to rewrite it check do do your due diligence if there is this um titles on amazon and like i said chat gpt is good to is good when it comes to giving you funny titles don't forget the prompt is very important and number three is you can use this chat gpt to create outlines all right so let's ask chat gpt to write an outline for us so you can write this give me a book outlines for the joke book for kids each chapter consists of different types of jokes so when you click enter now then it gives you another outlines you can see now outlines you can see the outlines you can see the outlines and like i said all these you can copy these rewrite them in your own word add your own chapter to it 
then you can begin to develop your outlines them you know publish your book on amazon then and you can also use ChatGPT to create a pen names for your book all right so let's ask ChatGPT to give us a pen name all right as you can see now ChatGPT is giving us a pen names a pen names to use as in mass power lily white oliver storm violet moon alice river and so so many like that these are pen names like i said check with with amazon kdp first before you do anything all right and you can also use this for book description guys in my next video i will show you where to get book description that will match your book pretty well all right this software is related to amazon and you will see how these are made and pretty quick and fast all right so enable to turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss my next video to see how where description are written perfectly well all right it will not be like chat gpt i'm going to show you my next video how these are written pretty much even the prettiest to write book and description guys i hope you have enjoyed this video if you have enjoyed this video let me know in the comment section below and if you have any question relate with me in the comment section below and i will try my best to answer every single question all right guys i will see you in my next video bye for now